So you want to learn the 52 gal. Hi, I'm Splatroid, a Splatoon content creator who has way too many hours of Splatoon 2 in the past year. I'm gonna tell you all you need to know about the 52 gal. This weapon is a very unique shooter because it has a two hit kill. Of course, it has a slower fire rate to counter that two hit kill. It has insane mobility and is very good at using main strafing to its advantage. Main strafing is when you are moving in one direction, then you suddenly hold the shoot button, then go in another direction. This is a very common dodging technique used by lots of competitive players. You definitely definitely want main strafing in your arsenal. This all seems way too good to be true, right? A two hit kill and good mobility? Sorry, but no. This weapon is the definition of RNG. RNG is random number generator, which for 52 gal means that the shots will be randomly thrown about the area around where you are actually aiming. The RNG is all right when you are on the ground, but when you jump, don't expect to hit all your shots, even if you're aiming dead on. To maximize your accuracy, staying on the ground is key when you are shooting or squid roll if you need to be evasive. In the heat of the moment, you will probably end up jumping around and shooting another player, but that's okay because dodging their shots is most likely going to be more important than hitting every single splotch of ink you shoot. The 52 gal paints surprisingly well when you jump up over and over again. The best kind of gear to run for this weapon would be swim speed, quick respawn, and self jump. The playstyle of a 52 gal is very aggressive, which is why quick respawn and self jump are great to get right back into the battle. Self jump hides your jump marker from people who aren't close to it, so you can dive back into the fight without being camped. Thank you to a squidman for letting me be a part of this. Make sure to subscribe to his YouTube channel, and feel free to drop a sub to my channel for some more Splatoon 3 videos. With that all said, I think you should know every Everything you need to know to get started with the 52 gal. Good luck out there.